I'm talking about divine healing. Ladies and gentlemen, you see, when unbelievers have no respect for divine process, if you're a child of God, when pain comes to you, is to say, the Lord is my strength, my light, is my shield. I say in the name of Jesus, you foul spirit of pain, I rebuke you. That should be the first response. Then you stand by faith, of course. Later you can follow up with appointment to see your doctor. You can follow up with other things. You, run, you know, rub whatever you want to rub. But we have been so carnally minded that that will be the last thing we do if we do it at all. If it's going to be divine healing, therefore, two things must be in place. Say the word of God and the spirit of God. Now the Bible already have provided the cure in Jesus. Say with me, Jesus Christ is the living word. Is the living word. And I've said this several times, the written word has taken the place of the unseen Christ. So anytime you have the word, you have the cure. 